हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम बैक टू माय चैनल फिन स्टॉप द वन स्टॉप डेस्टिनेशन फॉर स्टॉक मार्केट एंड फाइनेंशियल प्लानिंग फ्रेंड्स एज ए पार्ट ऑफ द स्विंग ट्रेडिंग सीरीज आई हैव कम अप विद अनदर स्विंग ट्रेड स्टॉक फ्रॉम द वन ऑफ द फास्टेस्ट ग्रोइंग सेक्टर इन इंडिया द स्पेशलिटी केमिकल सेक्टर स्पेशलिटी केमिकल प्रोडक्ट्स आर दोस व्हिच प्रोवाइड अ वाइड वैरायटी ऑफ इफेक्ट्स ऑन व्हिच मेनी अदर इंडस्ट्री सेक्टर्स रिलाय सच इंडस्ट्रीज व्हिच डिपेंड्स हेवीली ऑन स्पेशलिटी केमिकल्स आर ऑटोमोटिव एरोस्पेस फूड cosmetics agricultural manufacturing and textiles specialty chemicals can be some kind of formulation or single chemical entities whose chemical composition influences the end product the indian specialty chemical sector is expected to increase at a cagr of 12.4% that is from 32 us billion dollars in 2019 to an estimated 64 billion dollars by 2025 These specialty chemicals constitute 22% of the total chemicals and petrochemicals market in India. Before going further, I would request you to watch my playlist on multi-bagger stocks where I have made several videos on Lawrence Labs, Alkyl Amines, Tata Alexi, CDSL, etc. and also watch my playlist on stock market series for beginners both in English and Telugu and mutual funds where I have made several videos like top 5 large cap, mid cap, small cap, debt etc if you haven't watched them please go and watch it the links are in the description box and also in the i bar section also please follow us on telegram channel where i will post important updates on stocks on daily basis and also follow my pages on facebook and instagram the links are in the description box friends please don't forget to hit the like button your every like gives me motivation to make more and more videos and please subscribe to my youtube channel and hit the bell icon for all important notifications now let's come back to the topic the swing trade stock from specialty chemical sector is none other than navin florin navin florin international limited navin florin is one of the largest and the most respected indian manufacturers of specialty fluorochemicals it belongs to the padmanabh mahatlal group which is the one of the india's oldest industrial houses The company was established in the year 1967. It operates one of the largest integrated fluorochemical complexes in India with manufacturing locations located at Surat and Dahej in western India and Devas in central India. Navin Florin operates its business in four segments. They are refrigeration. The company is pioneer in manufacturing refrigerant gases in India. The second business segment is inorganic fluorides. The company has got more than 45 years of expertise in inorganic fluorine chemistry. In the third segment, the company's highest profit margin segment that is specialty fluorochemicals. The company has got large scale manufacturing capability and it is specialized in making custom synthesis products of fluorine based intermediates. And the fourth segment is cramps, contract research and manufacturing services. It is the fastest growing business segment. Navin Florin with its 45 years of expertise in fluorination chemistry it is presently focusing on providing contract research and manufacturing services to various customers if we look at its financials company financials are very good its revenue has increased from 1.01 to 1.27 from 2018 to 2021 whereas its profits has increased from 0.18 to 0.41 in 2020 but due to the covid pandemic it has decreased to 0.26 in 2021 All the values shown here are in thousand crores. Now let's see the past performance given by Navin Florin. In the past one week, the stock has given negative returns of minus eight percent. It has fallen from the levels of four thousand sixty. If you see one month chart, the stock has given returns of just zero point five one percent. That means stock has been retraced back to its same level. But friends, if you see one year chart, the stock has given excellent returns of eighty one point zero six percent. That means if you have invested 1 lakh one year ago it would have become 1 lakh 80000 by now Now let's see whether the stock is overvalued or undervalued Navin Florin PE the price to earning value is 71.43 whereas industrial PE is 23.75 that means stock is overvalued If you see price to book value Navin Florin PB is 11.26 whereas sector PB is 3.04 that means stock is overvalued But friends Navin Florin is an excellent growth stock for long term that's why it is trading at higher PE value Now let's analyze this stock technically by using charts Friends I am using Jiroda for chart analysis if you want to open a DMAT account through Jiroda the link is in the description box 
If you see the Navin Florin chart, the stock is presently trading at the levels of 3714. It has fallen from the levels of 4060. And its RSI is presently at 39.64 and it is racing towards oversold zone. If we zoom in, you can see that MACD indicator has already given bearish crossover signal. That means stock can be bearish in the coming days. Also you can see that there has been huge selling from the last two sessions. In the last session, there is huge sell off. The volumes are increased more than 30,000. So friends, this stock may further fall to the levels of 3,500 where it can take support from 100 day moving average. If the bearishness continues, it may still fall to the levels of 3,250 where it can take support from 200 day moving average. Friends, if the stock gets support from 100 day moving average or 200 day moving average, it can bounce back to the levels of 4150. Now let's see some buy levels and targets. The buy levels are level 1 3580, level 2 3500, level 3 3250. And the targets are target 1 3800, target 2 4000, target 3 4150. You can keep stop loss at 3150 and the time period you have to hold is 2 to 8 weeks. Friends, you need to invest your amount partially at each and every buy levels and hold the stock for at least 2 to 8 weeks to achieve these targets. This stock Navin Florin has got huge potential to give at least returns of 20% in 2 to 8 weeks. Friends, if you want its complete analysis, please write in the commentary box. I will definitely make a video on it. A small disclaimer friends, the levels, recommendations and targets are only for educational purpose. Please do your own research and consult your financial advisor before taking any investment decision. If you like my explanation, please like, share, comment and please please subscribe to my YouTube channel. Thank you friends.